Hello, and welcome back to Fields and Skylines. Let's play Farming Simulator 22 White Farm. We're in March. We have a bunch of work to do. We got eggs to sell. We have milk to sell. We have cows to buy. We have fields to plant and mulch and not mulch, fields to cultivate and plant. We have all sorts of stuff to do, including buying a brand new field. So, this will be a fun episode. It's our first new field on this farm, on this Let's Play. Took us quite some time to get there, but we are there. Um, let's check on some animals. I'm sure they're all going to need some food. Chickens probably are all right. We could feed them, but they're okay. Um, there's probably a few that need to be sold off here. Yeah, like about 30, 20, 20 chickens to be sold off. Ah, you know what? Let's just leave them. We're good. We're full up. We have all the chickens we can handle, I think. Um, I think this will be a full pen, 360. All our chickens are full. We're buying five more cows. At least, I think once we buy that field, we can afford it. Um, let's check the cows and see. Yeah, they definitely need some food. Um, straw, we'll have to nudge the straw around. And there's milk to be sold, of course. So, first, let's buy our field. Um, we can afford two different fields. We can afford both. Field 26, which is 1.67 half acres, or field 21, it's almost two half acres, 132,000. We have $215,000. So either one would be in our budget. I know this one is bigger, but it's also pretty far away. And so just for convenience sake, I am going to purchase um, this grass field right here. Uh, this will allow us to get all of our cows in this barn. And I don't know how many we need. Um, it holds, what do we hold here? 45, we have 30. Um, so we're probably going to buy five a month for the next three months, just so that it's balanced out. We're going to sell off any babies that we may get. And so we can have them not getting in the way of good milk. So we got that going on this month. We're going to be, like I said, planting. We have a field here that looks like it's ready to harvest and ready to be rolling. So what we're probably going to need to do is harvest this and then roll it. I'm going to be renting the roller out anyways. So that is good news. I know the grass field over there is ready. So we'll probably do silage with one of these fields, hay with the other, uh, silage with the smaller field, which is this one, and hay in the bigger field. So lots to get done today. Um, glad you're here for the ride. It's going to be a busy day. The other thing we're going to be doing is we're going to be updating this case here a little bit. We are going to buy the, the sensor, the precision farming tractor sensor. So that the other one we kind of took away by the green tractor out of the way and then we'll be in good shape on that it's probably not a must have but i think it's just it's fourteen thousand fifteen thousand dollars if you round up um just a smart purchase we're done um and then we still have plenty of money to buy anything else we might need to buy. Um, maybe like, I don't know, a uh, better limer, lime spreader or something like that. Um, but yeah, that is our plan. So what we're going to probably do here is um, we're going to mow. We're going to jump in the John Deere, grab the mower, and we're going to mow our new field. And since we're going to probably then tether it, and then I'll mow, well, I'll probably mow both fields, starting with the new one. 
I'll get on the tether with um, a different tractor, or we'll figure it out. So it's all going to be a big time lapse. Um, the other thing we have to get done is we have to get um, cultivating our small little field over here and get sunflowers planted in. So I think I'll set a worker off and then we'll get red cultivating. This is the cultivator though, so this is gonna look silly. We'll just drop the tractor off, one more right there. We'll whip it around. He's gonna do the cultivating and then the planting. And our red tractor will do the mowing. So, a little change of plans, no, none of it hurts. I just want to start getting some stuff done. Like I said, we can use workers. We got enough money to use some workers. I'm a little trap right there. Um, but yeah, we definitely want to, uh, definitely want to get the work done. So I'm going to go ahead, jump this into a, a time lapse here, and we will uh, get the work done. So I'll see you at a good stopping point.
the mowing, tettering, done. Um, I drove, or I had a worker drive, my greenie, up here because we are going to buy a lime spreader. Because I got to spread some lime on at least three fields today. And I figured, oops, one more that that would be a good use of money. Don't have a lot of stuff here to buy. And then eventually we're gonna have to drive up here to lease a roller. Um, but for now, because of money being tight, I was thinking we could get either for 45, we could get this, which holds 9,000, spreads at 12, day, 12 meters. Uh, 15,000 spreads 12 meters. This one holds 6,000, spreads 18 meters, 21,000. Uh, 18,500 spreads 42 meters. However, it's 85,000. So I like this one right here. It holds 7,000, which is a little less than those other ones, but it spreads the full 42. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and purchase this spreader just for lime. All right, spending some of our hard-earned money. And then we're going to take this back to the farm, and we're going to definitely go out, and we're going to lime today with this uh, before we plant. And I'll get the liming done. So that's awesome that we got this. We still have 53000 This will be enough to lease. The sprayer that we're going to need for the next couple months, the roller that we're going to need this month and next month, um, so we can get our planting in and I think we're in good shape I think we're going to do sunflowers and corn and um, soybean although I was thinking of doing oats again just for the extra straw because of that straw advantage we have I still think we have a good amount of straw um, uh, for us even if we turn some of it into silage so yeah i think we're in good shape i'm excited that big field you know two fields we're gonna get both hay and silage in one day that's awesome so i am so very excited but yeah so we're gonna mulch this we're gonna put sunflowers in there not a very big field but it definitely will get the job done as a little extra money a little extra crop money um, when we need it and then we're going to have to mulch um, one, or not mulch, we're going to have to cultivate one of the other fields we have before we put um, corn down in it. I haven't decided quite yet where we're putting the corn or where we're putting soy. Um, but yeah, we, we will get it there. So let's go ahead. I don't think I have any lime down on the farm. Any bags of it laying around. There might be lime in the spreader. The other spreader already. Um, if there is, it's okay. Fill. Lots of it. Can't make that turn. Alright. Out of control. Terrible track. So we'll go ahead and get this line. I'm then going to hook up to the row. Um, been a lot of time lapse already. So I think what I'm going to do is we'll get through liming this. I'll do the rowing and the bailing off camera, so to speak. Um, I forgot to hook up the sensor. That is very much needed. Let me race back to get that. So, but yeah, we're going to hook up the sensor. And then I'll do the liming, start the planting, and maybe that will be where we're at. As you can see, I really messed up the pallets over there. I need to clean that up. I'll probably clean that up offline. I'll get start getting them stacked up. Um, on a trailer. A little upset that I did that, but what you gonna do when you're driving out of control? So 
so yeah what an exciting start to this year um i think that we are oh we have to of course we have eggs to sell milk to sell animals to buy so we have all that to do uh, maybe i'll do a lot of that get a worker when we're planting uh, and we'll do all that uh, with a worker planting and that can take us maybe to the end of the video So I'm going to try to get down the center. I think 42 should hit uh, the whole field all the way. Let's go ahead, turn on our sensor. Let's unfold it. Not that. Let's do that. And then let's turn our climb on pull back a little bit to make sure we're getting it all and there we are lime in our small little field well like i said we're gonna have to lime the grass two grass fields and um i think just having this larger container will make easier work of it less trips back to refill. Um, and that's what we really want, what we're really looking for. So, all in all, good times, good times. Whoa, didn't want to do that. Hit the wrong button. Lost a bit of lime there, we'll be all right. So. Let's go ahead and fold it back up and turn it off. Now we have another thing that we have to store somewhere on the farm. I'm not sure where. Uh, I think this grass field right here, along with constructing another cow pen, are our next two major uh, money purchases, along with maybe another tractor uh, and things like the lion, uh, things like the roller and the spreader could be so so yeah I, I i'm just excited i love this time like i was getting a little frustrated with this map because we weren't really progressing i'm not sure where i'm gonna store this guy i think i'll just pop him right here oh. doesn't have a cover we we'll probably need to get him under cover somewhere Maybe I'll store it where I've been storing red and then find a new home for red. Um, I need to get the planter out. Yeah, yeah there is lime in here. All right. Let me unload. Where should I unload it? Maybe. Well, I'll just drop it down. We can unload, figure out unloading of it later. I just want to get him off working on planting. It's not much area to plant, but it is a job I want to start so that we can start selling the milk and whatnot. Um, The other thing I've been thinking about buying is possibly a new animal mixer, food mixer. The one we have is a little small. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna do that though until we buy our new cow pen. So we could have maybe one in each cow pen. So work with that. Um, I don't know. I don't know um, exactly, but we will have to figure that out at some point. So with this, I want to go through. 
boom. And let's go up. Boom. We have to turn it on before we can plant, but it's. Oh, I'm having all sorts of driving issues today. Oh, wait, what fruit am I on? It says I am on corn. Sunflowers. There we go. Corn is for the next month. We'll have him crack on, and I think we'll just give him a little bit of a watch to make sure everything is okay. And we will go from there. Hmm. Yep, I think it's gonna go all right. I didn't do a headland at the bottom. Hopefully it'll be all right. If not, we'll have to uh, fill in. Hopefully there's enough fertilizer and seeds in here for this field. Uh, if we run out, we run out. Uh, what was I gonna do? Sell some milk. All right, that's this tractor. Uh, yeah, I think we'll sell milk. And then check in on our planter, finish up the planting, and then we'll call it an episode. I have a lot of yard cleanup to do off camera. Maybe I'll buy some cows too after I sell them some milk. And milk is forty seven at the bakery, and then we'll go to the wholesale um, with what's ever left because the bakery doesn't always take all the milk. So I'm going to go ahead and drive the milk up there, do a couple jump cuts here with the milk, and then the animal buying. So I'll go ahead and I'll see you up at the bakery. So we are at the bakery. And we will sell whatever milk we can. Not a whole lot. Uh, yeah, our environmental score is $52, $545. Um, probably sell the rest of it here at the wholesale. We'll get quite a bit more. We didn't sell a whole lot. I think we sold about 700 meters there. Not a whole lot. Much better sell here. Yep, four, five, nine, seven, four thousand five hundred ninety-seven, four hundred forty-two 442 environmental score. Our environmental score might be a little bit down because of the new field we just bought, but all in all, very happy. I am going to jump cut back to the farm, pick up the animal, uh, the animal trailer, and buy some animals, and then uh, I'll be back. See you in a bit. Okay, we are back. Um, I have jumped into Greeny. Uh, he's out of seeds. We'll put some fur in him as well. Uh, huh. 
<sighs> I knew we were going to run out of seats. I just didn't know when. Um, it's okay. We got a little bit of fur right here. We can refuel. Or re refuel. Refill. And then we'll get this guy going. And then I'll head off and get... We'll head off then and go get animals. And I think that'll be the last of the video. Um, a lot done. I don't know if we're going to pick up in March again. Oh, man, I can't hit those anymore. Oh. Um, I don't know if we'll pick up in March again and finish up some jobs in March or what cause we have to roll. So I think we're going to come back in March again and finish off the rolling. Uh, possibly. We shall see how it goes. All right, that looks all right. Let's worker it. Um, but yeah, I think we'll watch him for a bit. <sighs> yeah, he looks good. All right. So let's go ahead and jump back in red. And let's get, we'll drive out to the animals, pick up some animals, and we'll call it an episode. We're going to do five cows. Um, and then we'll pick up back in March. I'll probably do some, I'll get the grass stuff done off camera. Um. Uh, but like I said, we'll do the rolling next episode. We'll, you know, probably do the liming of the grass fields next episode. And maybe if there's time, jump into April. Um, I think I might have bit off a little bit more than I could chew for this episode, but that, that happens. It's okay. It's all, it's all good stuff that we're doing. Um, I'm just excited uh, with the new lime spreader field. We still have put enough money that we can hire workers. Uh, there still could be opportunities for some contracts. So let's go ahead. We're going to do Holstein. We're going to do five, well, seven and seven is 14. We could almost buy them all in two months. Uh, we're going to do five, three months worth. All right. Okay. That's good. So our milk sales and our egg sales should be able to cover the cost of our cow sales. Plus, like I said, I think we're going to have a couple baby cows next month that we can sell. Uh, they don't sell for a lot, but it's like free money. So yeah, I thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're enjoying the channel, please subscribe um, and comment down below with any suggestions or tips or help that you may have. For me. And if, thank you and have a wonderful rest of your day. Goodbye.